Welcome to The Right Approach, sponsored by Michelob Ultra. We're here at Cascades Golf Course on a beautiful Tuesday morning with a special guest from JTV, Mr. Andy Hawley. I can't believe I'm a guest. I can't Thank believe you. you are either. Thank I've been asking you for 10 years. Thank you for having me on my old program. No problem. <laughs> I, th you know, I thought you had the time to do it. You know what? I, uh, you're, you're so good at it. And I used to get made fun of so much because I'm not that good of a golfer. <laughs> So, you know, between yourself and Phil Fishmeister, I mean, you guys do an awesome job showcasing uh, local golfers in town well, and this beautiful course. Thank you. So we're showcasing a local golfer, Andy Holly, who doesn't golf enough. Oh, I might. It depends but, um, on who you ask. But there's a lot of stuff on his plate right now. And um, you're going to explain right off the bat here what one of your newest... Uh, endeavors is yeah so uh in november my wife and i um we uh we are now partners with uh with my dad as owners of the company we had a a great partner over the over the years uh some may know norman jackson uh, bill boyer and uh, bill became a great friend of mine over the last 20 years and uh, had an opportunity to uh uh, to work with Bill and uh, and now ownership is uh, entirely in our family. So very very That's cool. Awesome. And uh, last summer we brought uh, my brother Joe on, mm -hmm. uh, yep. who you know. Yep. So it's uh, it's it's like the 1980s and 90s down there, where all all four <laughs> of the Hollies are in the same building. It's uh, it's wild. That's got to be a little crazy. It is once crazy, in a while, doesn't it? It is, yeah. But it's good. I, I mean, we, it, we enjoy it. But it took getting you to be an owner to get you out here to be a guest on your own show. No, that's not true. <laughs> I just, I, yeah, you know, the, produ we, the producer Noah. Every time I told him that you wanted to have me on, he scoffed at it. So, but I'm finally here. I'm finally here. So. Yeah, he was way down the. You were, you were down the list, but we got you on. Yeah, but we're, you and I actually, you know, you and I met. I first golf league I played in. It was at Arbor Hills. I didn't really play a lot of golf. I right. was, think I was 24 when I started that league. And um, you were in that league, yep. one of the great golfers in town. I was a little nervous about it. And then I realized uh, you're a pretty nice guy. So uh, <laughs> you, you really helped me uh, enjoy the game of golf because I always thought good golfers were, uh, were jerks. And, uh, and you proved we'll that not we'll to be you. the case, <laughs> we'll um, which you. helped me enjoy the game. So, but yeah, that's really when I first started no, we, playing. I just love golf. We had, some, there were some good times. That was a good league. And yeah in at old arbor hills with the old building and i remember a couple of shots that your dad made when he played in that league oh my gosh but, oh my gosh he shouldn't have been out but that's okay no i i could embarrass him with a shot but i'm nah, not going to care. i'm not going to that's right all now. right but um no but that's that's really cool so the right approach to the show itself um we were just talking about how yeah. long it's been going on and i remember doing a show with you out at lakeland hills in 2007. That's crazy, right? So 16 years ago, about how many shows do you think you've done overall? Well, I know, it's crazy uh, to think. We probably, on this golf show, we've probably done 80 to 100. Mm -hmm. and, and it really, kind of golf in Jackson, the golf show or us covering golf in Jackson really started with uh, uh, Elaine Crosby hosted a show uh, for us for years called mm -hmm. On the Tee. Right. And um, and then we just decided to start featuring local golfers mm -hmm. and golf uh, golf uh, courses. And you've done them on a lot of courses. A lot of courses. Yeah. But what's been nice is just you know, as you know, the amount of people you can, you meet through oh, the man. game of golf. Oh, I man. mean, it's just it's life changing. It's really yeah. not as much about the round of golf. It's yeah. about the people. Um, and and every time I hear this song, I think, is that your ringtone? That's my ringtone. <laughs> is that I the had to shut it off. Yeah, I oh had to shut gosh. it off. Oh my gosh, I thought I was getting ready to close my eyes and take a nap with Jim Nance here. Well, I just had to shut it off. Um, I'll answer but it later. Yeah, no, anyway, I mean, we've probably done 80 some, 80 to 100 at least, and uh, yeah, showcased a lot of golf and a lot of golfers. It's a great, way, cool. to, uh, great way to highlight uh, you know, who are these guys that win these local tournaments, right? Like, right. who are they other than also, just their name? But you've also highlighted business for sure. members and their golf games, which aren't always Aren't always superb. great, right, yeah. I mean, but, but uh, that's teachers, a good way to get them out and talking. Yeah, and that's a great How much business is done on a golf course? I mean, a lot. a lot of the people I talk to, you know, they say, you know, that's that that was one of the only place, places business was done years ago. Yeah. And, um, yeah. I didn't know what that meant until probably, you know, I got into my 30s. And it's mm -hmm. it's not actually like 
doing a deal on the course, right? right? It's just, it's an it's opportunity. It's a relationship. Yeah, and, get, yeah. You know, what, what else can you do where you're uh, hanging out with someone for four and a half hours, That's right. uh, you know, outside on a, on a beautiful day playing a game? So, yeah. yeah, it's pretty good stuff. It is. It's pretty cool. So just on another line away from golf a little bit, what is what is your least favorite thing to do and your most favorite thing to do at the at the shop? Yeah, wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great question. My I least I'd bring that one up without letting you know. My least favorite thing to do um, well, my favorite thing to do is going to work every day. Okay. I will say that. My Good. favorite thing is our team is... I think that's obvious when, yeah. when you watch on your morning show. Our team is awesome, and uh, really, they're, they're, the, they're the key. My least favorite thing to do... Um, there's places that we have, you know, you have to go and you have to do... My least favorite thing to do would be um, attend a dinner function on a night that my daughter has a game, Something going right? On. Yeah. You know, other than that, you know, and I don't you finally get a day off and you're like, oh, and I got to go do that. Yeah, tonight. but you yeah. know what? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, my least favorite thing probably would be what we're doing right now. No, I'm just kidding. Golfing? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Me being... Okay, I'm done. No, no. me being interviewed. No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't know how I'd answer that question. No. I can't answer it, so it's probably a good, good thing. Well, I got another question, and I'm going to wait till we get on the green, and uh, okay. I'm going to ask you a good one that you don't know about. So, well, I'm looking forward to it. We'll now, you, I, I saw on Facebook uh, you had a hole in one here. Is that why you're dragging me to the same? Yeah, hole? I want to try to get one on video. Okay, fine. Jeez, yeah. unbelievable. It was, it was I don't know, 10, 12 days ago. 10, 12 so, days ago. Yeah. So yeah. maybe we can do it again. Okay. All right. We'll be right back. Welcome back to The Right Approach, sponsored by Michelob Ultra. We're at Cascades Hole number four with uh, special guest Andy Hawley. Special. And we're we're going to play hole four, and uh, we're going to try to get a hole in one on, on uh, video. I would love that. So I would love that. Now, you had, as I mentioned, you had a hole in one on four uh, just recently? 10, 12 days ago, yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah. What'd you hit? Six iron. Okay. And, and, um, we just went went in. And okay. So we're gonna try to do that again, but this is to see if you can do it and match me and, and cover that skin up. I'm nervous. Uh, I'm do always I, nervous. Do I go here. first? You're you're up. Okay. You got the honors. As I would say, at this at this juncture of the round, I would probably have the honors if you and I were probably because you probably birdied three and I'd have part it. Oh. That's part of your sandbagging. Just trying to get a bet going. Uh, beautiful. You got a six iron? I do. I have a six iron. What do we think this was? About 180? Yeah, 180. I Downwind. Mean, and for me, I mean, a hole in one would be would be great, but. Uh, Downwind, you got a cart path you can use if you hit a little short. Beauty. Give a little kick to the right here. It did. Did it get on? Yes, you're, it's all over the sand trap. It kicked to the right a little bit okay. on the back of the green. I, I could live with that. Yep. You're a player. Was, I, was that intimidating to you? Probably not. It is a little bit now that, I, now that you're on, and I don't know if we have the closest two going or anything. We do. But, okay. we have, we've got a lot of bets going that. right now. Smooth there. Oh, give me one good hop. Oh man, I think Greg. that's pretty close. Yeah, pretty close. Pretty good shot there. Thank you. How do you do that? How do you do it where you just kind of hit it with that little ball flight right at the hole like that? I'm not actually sure. I just hit it and it goes where I'm looking. Yeah, it's good <laughs> to be you. Good to be you.
It looks like I gave you the wrong club on, maybe on purpose so that I can get closer. I'm not sure if I did that. <laughs> you not, did but. do that on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, I'll tell you, you know, I struck the ball well, and but, this is, you know. A little, a little history for the, for the right approach historians out there. The first time we did this at Lakeland Hills on hole one, I hit it on in two and you hit it over in two and uh, you chipped it in. I did. I did. To tie you. To tie me. To tie you. So. All right. So what's this going to do? You're, uh, you know, you've played, you've played as many rounds at this golf course as maybe, you know, maybe well, anyone, maybe Greg. A f maybe a few. You're going to chip it down. Probably it's going to go about five or six feet to the right. Okay. Do I need to get it over that hill? Um, you need to get it over this. You probably need to land it up by this big, bright yellow spot there. Yeah. Yeah. It's all coming back to me now, the you scrambles and following your directions. There you go. And then when I don't do we, it, we walking away couple. disappointed. Yeah. Oh, I just kind of yanked it out that way. Yeah. Might end up working out. Speed was good. Yeah. Weird lie. It's good touch for all the golf you've been playing. Say it. Uh, so you're still so away, before, sir. You're, yeah, you're still away. But before <laughs> before you hit this putt, um, I've away. got a question for you. Okay. When are you going to play in a city tournament? Oh my God. Because you said you were going to at some point. When are you going to do that? Like a local tournament? Yeah, one of our city tournaments. I'm going to play in the senior city when I'm old enough. Oh. Yeah, I think. But you're only like, what, 32? 32? I don't even know how old you are. <laughs> I'll be 41. Really? Soon. Yeah. How old are you? I, I know you don't want to say. I don't remember being 41. You get discounts at hotels and stuff? I do. That's how old I am. Gosh, you played good for that age. There. All right. So I'm still away. Yeah. <sighs> Knock it in. There shouldn't be much in that pot. Okay. Might, it might go just a hair to the right. This is where I'm nervous now. Yeah, it might go hair to the right. Well, you got a Scotty Cameron, so you got a really good chance of making it. For sure. I've, now, I've had this putter. You've had that one for a while. 16 years. Yeah. I feel like if, I'm, if I miss this, I let not only myself down, but I let you down. <laughs> You always make it though. The greens are in really good shape. They're pretty good right now. Oh! Did it go just a touch to the right? Just a touch. What a good stroke. Thank you. And I, I know you want this really bad because that means you would beat me by two strokes. Two strokes on one hole. Wow. You know, it doesn't matter how many, as long as you're you're winning, right? <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Oh! And then that one went right. Hey. Another successful show. Yeah, it was fun. Thank you. We, for, didn't, lo we didn't lose a ball. No, thank you for having me. Uh, I really appreciate it, and thanks for hosting the show. You and uh, Phil Fish do a do yeah, a great it's job. It's fun. I'm glad. I'm glad we got to do this. I've been asking you to do it for yeah, a while. Yeah, a lot of fun. Thank you. So, thank you.